So what are we gonna do? I was thinking about uh, you know that one fishing place that we went to a couple weeks ago where we caught all those um, warmouth at. Yeah, that's how. Like oh, hold on. Hey, Mike, what's going on? What up? Man, not much. Uh, what you doing? Uh, we're just sitting here thinking about where we're trying to go fishing at. Alright, I need some help. I'm stuck out here at uh, that pit. Oh shoot, okay. Well, we'll be on our way then. Alright, bye. All See right. you soon, man. Bye. 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 Looks like we're going to pull Mike out. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Where's this fool at? Ah! <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Look at him buried. <laughs> Yo, he's buried for real though. <laughs> do you want to pull him out or do you want to make him work for it? Ah. Uh, <laughs> don't we have just the right thing to do? Yes, we do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> let's use it. You know, it could be quick and easy or it could be hard. Let's teach him a lesson. Yeah, let's go. All right, Mike. Here's what we got for you. All right. <laughs> we got a shovel. And we got these here tracks. Let's get you pulled out. Now, X Bull hooked us up with some recovery tracks. Using these tracks, I'm hoping that we can go ahead and pull Mike out of these, I don't know, sandy situation. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get these things unhooked. Now, X Bull sent a uh, bracket to mount these. Now, I kind of modified it and didn't do it exactly how it was intended for, but. Some of you guys might actually like this modification. You may want to do it yourself. So I'm gonna go over it. Okay, we got that one off. There we go. And we got that one off. There we go. So these little uh, plastic um, connectors here are actually designed to, uh, they're designed to hold it to a roof rack and I've got them the opposite direction of what they're supposed to be. If you know anything about the, the tracks and how they mount, you'll know what I mean. But what I did was a modification to them. I drilled a hole in the actual plastic uh, mount and reversed it the opposite direction to use this as the mount. So that way I didn't have to drill holes in my truck. So guys, you, you may want to do that yourselves. Just a quick little tip. So right now we're going to use this recovery track. It has two sides. This is the side that's going to grip onto the tires. And this is the side that's going to grip into the dirt. And how this, does it work? This is the side that I hit Ricky with. <laughs> <laughs> but how's it going to work, Mike? Uh, well, basically, the truck's weight needs to actually be on these traction boards, okay? And then when the tire is on these little grips that are on here, it's going to pull itself out. And then you got the grips on the bottom, which they're going to grab the sand. Hopefully. It, yeah, it kind of keeps it from sliding easy. Like, I can't hardly slide that like that. But when you got the weight of the vehicle on top of that, it also is going to really get good traction. So we're going to see if we can get this to work. So we're going to put it in. We're going to dig it out. We're just going to create a little bit of an angle so we can put this in straight. And then we'll be good to go. We're going to dig this out uh, just a little bit. Take this hump out from behind it. That way the vehicle can kind of come back pretty much straight without having to climb a hill when it's coming out. Dig out from under the tire, just enough to get the board up under the tire. Now you don't want to go all the way under the tire because what's going to happen is the truck's just going to fall down in the hole. So you want to go try to go as far as you can, but not all the way. Okay, okay. We see that it could get a truck out, but can it get a car? Let's try a car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! We got this! We got this! Uh, uh, you're bottomed out, Ricky. Mike, you got them recovery tracks? Wait, let's see if I'm gonna stop. Oh no, we're gonna get it done. Be done. <laughs>
That's the one that did it. <laughs> so when you get home, you probably want to um, get the sand out of there. Right, we're gonna um, probably wash this car and mm -hmm. make it sparkly. Probably professionally detailed for the wife. Mm -hmm. And people are gonna hey, be uh, asking you. None, none of you guys, okay, who knows my wife, don't tell her about this, okay? Secret. Video is going viral. No, it's not gonna go viral. It's part of video. I'm gonna ensure it goes viral. No, no, no. Babe, I love you. Dig, dig. Babe, I love you. Get to digging. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I'm gonna get your car out. I swear. <laughs> X bull, don't let me down. <laughs> no bullshit. <Okay. laughs> I think it's good right there, bro. Let's go. It's right up on the tire now. I don't know about you guys, but I believe this could get my, my stuff out. I believe in X Bull. I believe in it. I believe in the recovery tracks. I really do. Check. I believe you believe in them. I believe in them. I believe, I believe in it. I believe they'll I be walk, great. I'm, I'm in the church car. of recovery, and this is the recovery in this. I think you should That's bolt them to the back bumper of your car. All right. We got it out level. I'm going to go ahead and stick this. Dig See, I'm a little bit curious because this is not a knobby tire, so can this even grip the recovery track? I'm, I don't know, but we're about to find out. Get out of here! It's Dylan from Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> I, should, I stopped the car. I should have stopped the car. I was shocked that it got me out for real. <laughs> Overall thoughts on the Expo tracks. What do you think, Mike? Great tracks. They're just as good a, good a quality as any other track that I've seen. Uh, and you know, one thing I did notice, uh, it was pretty awesome. You can stack it up like this. It, it, that'll probably lift it up a little bit. But I don't think you should run with just two. Run with four. That's for sure. All right, and besides uh, recovery and getting yourselves out, when you have the Expo tent on the roof of your truck, getting your vehicle level is another issue that you may have. And these actually work quite well if you need to lift one side up a little higher. That's just a little higher, and if you can stack them, and you can get higher. That'll help your vehicle out for your x tent. Now, if you guys like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Follow us on all social media. And get out there and challenge the outdoors. Bam!